Hello all. Well, there's been a few sagas and dramas and pains in the asses and with the speedo on this my, this thing, my bike, and um, put a new sensor cable, swap swap speedos, tried a speedo which I knew worked, but didn't record MPH and uh, nothing. So I have no idea what's going wrong. What did happen is the top bolt on, on the anti-dive bar work loose and the whole thing dropped down ABS light came on and it never went off and uh, that's what I've been pretty much been doing just faffing around with it the last few weeks plus it's been raining a lot here so what I did wired myself a nice sat nav speedo I've got a nice I don't know if you can pick up on that i got a nice USB which tells you what the battery's doing so uh, I quite like the sat nav speedo. Everything else works on here. And maybe I'll fit an ace well in the winter. Uh, my friend Paul Rimmer, he has actually fitted one. He's a very, very clever chap. And he's sort of helped me try to figure out the problem here. But without replacing, I think there's a, like a disc, magnetised disc on the front end. I can't think what else I can do. Tried moving it around, tried moving the sensor around on the front plate, and it just won't bloody work. So, uh, had Lambrettas and Speedo was a luxury, so, but I expect a bit better on a, you know, a bike like this. Um, I don't know, I don't want to get into a slanging match, but I don't understand why they couldn't ever get this thing working properly. It's the second one I've had, but got the sat nav on it now so um nice little speedo wiring really easy to wire in you got a i took its own designated earth from the battery tray wired it through the through the tunnel there really easy and i traced them out but paul did tell me that the black wire in the headset top is a switched live so basically when you now when you turn it all off it's dead because my concern was the sat nav or the, the USB, the little LED display running the battery down. So now when you turn it on, it all comes to life. It takes a couple of minutes for the sat nav, find the signal, but it's pretty good. And I quite like it and it's a bit different. And I've still got the, like, the temperature, rev counter, fuel on the gauge there. So... That will do me for now. And what I did is I didn't sort of drill any, didn't drill the leg shift toolbox. I fed the wire around the back. So if we get an ace well, get it working in the winter, if I feel that way inclined, then uh, it can all just go, go back to normal. And I got the nice USB port there. What I've been doing, I gave it a nice go over a couple of times with the ceramic wax. So, uh, She's looking quite shiny, very shiny. So there you go. So I'm getting out on it soon. So uh, I'll catch up with you all later. Thanks for watching as always. Cheers. Bye-bye.